Misty ate 398 over nine is one of the two George daughters that we're gonna be selling, both of them very outstanding heifers. This is an October 2020 heifer, so she would break off the class from those Septembers. This is just a really nice, balanced, deep, heavy muscled heifer with a lot of eye appeal to her. Very easy fleshing, sired by the Mr. V8 274 over seven bull George, who I mentioned is one of our most popular bulls from a social media standpoint. This bull has been gentle his entire life. When he was weaned, he was a former show champion too. He was reserve champion at the uh, kickoff classic one year, but he was the number one weaning weight bull we had that year on his actual weaning weight was George. And he's been a gentle disposition bull since birth. Just extremely docile. He's a big, powerful, dark pigmented bull. Very unique also because he breeds light birth weight. George is a bull that has a lot of performance to him, but yet he had a light birth weight himself and he breeds light birth weight. He also is very prepotent for the darker color and the dark pigmentation. And George's dad was a bull, Mr. V8 354, over six. And he was a bull that had won the All-American that we had sold a young man in Louisiana. And then Mr. Ernest Cannon at, at Windy Hills bought this bull for a herd bull from that young man. And when I was consulting with Ernest Cannon and visiting his ranch, I noticed these caves out of this 354 bull who was a rock son who was also an international champion for Derek Smith and his family. The caves were good on him. And I went back and asked Mr. Cannon, could I breed this bull and breed him natural at the ranch for a year? And that's how we got George. George's mother was another show cow, 58 over six that we owned with the Hilton Watson family. And she goes back to the national champion cow, 73 over five and then another national champion, an international champion, 165 over four, who was a cow that we sold half interest in for $100,000 to Mr. Nelson Rushi. She was one of our great cows, great cow family. You get our book and look at it. This bull comes from a long line of national champion cows. The mother of, of this beautiful heifer is a cow, 171, that we showed when she was a young heifer, uh, wasn't a national champion, but was a competitive cow. And her sire is a bull that was immediately identified by AVBA as a very strong carcass bull, Mr. V8 463 over six. And he was a Carew son that was a national champion bull in 2009 under Gerald Young. And uh, he had another brother show 442 that showed with him. They were both flip-flopped a lot of times who would win. But Gerald made this bull champion at Shreveport, Louisiana in 2009. And immediately when his calves were born and we were starting to gather carcass information on it, that bull rose to the top as one of the top bulls in the breed from a carcass standpoint. And if you look at this heifer and look at her data, when you get the sow catalog at the bottom, it's gonna have the carcass data out of five of the six traits, she's in the top 10%. She's a top 10% for tenderness, top 10% for yield grade, top 10% for ribeye area, top 10% for marbling, and top 3% for carcass weight. So of the six traits that are listed, she's in the top 10% on five of those traits. So anyone that would be saying, you know, I, I wanna really concentrate on this carcass aspect, this is a heifer, if you're talking about it and you want to get serious, you might want to look at her and her half-sister because they've got that as well as uh, good performance data as far as weights being in the top 5% for weaning weight and yearling weight and uh, I think top 3% for total maternal. And when you watch the video on these heifers, this is a heifer that travels real well and holds that top line together. Very level top line donor. She's a good striding heifer, but you're gonna be impressed with her depth of body, but also with that depth, she's got added length of body. 
lot of quality to her with just off the chart numbers. She's going to be a easy keeping, good doing kind of a female. A lot, a lot of quality on her.